noise. Let's control the noise levels. Want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? A good automation system needs two things. The first thing is data, a lot of data. Data like temperature readings, the status of light bulbs or doors. The second thing is control. Home automation systems need to be able to control devices to be able to change those temperatures and light switches. One of the things that was missing in my home automation system is sound levels around the house. I need to collect this data for two reasons. One. To help run home automation rules and two is to maintain a healthy noise level around the house it's no surprise that numerous studies have linked noise pollution to increase anxiety and depression so i needed to build a mirror to be more aware of the noise levels around me one of the obvious places to start was my tv And to help me determine the noise levels, I created this DIY device and placed it next to the speakers on the TV. I then used the data it sends to display an alert on the TV screen when the volume is too loud to lower the volume. And it looks something like this. The device uses a microphone to monitor the sound and it sends the values over the network. I then use a home automation rule to trigger an alert on the TV when the volume level reaches a certain value. I'm using MQTT to communicate the levels. One thing I want to note is I am using the raw data coming from microphone and I didn't convert them to decibels. I wanted to keep the system as simple as possible without the need to calibrate it with known dB levels. In terms of hardware, I used a Wemos D1 Mini which is an ESP8266 board with built-in Wi-Fi capabilities and I paired it with an analog microphone. This microphone responds to the full human ear frequencies which is 2Hz all the way to 20kHz. This microphone also has an adjustable gain to control its sensitivity and since the Wemos D1 Mini has a built-in USB, I powered it directly using the USB port on the back of my TV. This ensures that the microphone is on when the TV is on and vice versa. To visualize the audio levels, I wanted to have an intuitive graphical presentation that's easy to understand. So I made this. It shows the audio levels in real time and helps me define the volume thresholds for each room. I built it using JavaScript and WebSockets running on the Wemos D1 Mini itself. To set up and configure the device, I created a self-hosted setup portal. It creates a Wi-Fi hotspot that I can connect to and provide the Wi-Fi and MQTT credentials as well as the MQTT topic. A future enhancement I would like to do is to trigger the alerts on a rolling average. I currently have a simple rule that triggers when the volume reaches a certain value. This enhancement would minimize false alerts coming from very short sound bursts like a gunshot in a movie. I am also thinking of adding an infrared LED to control the TV directly from the device without having to go through home automation systems. In fact, if you have noticed, I already started that by adding the infrared LED to the device. This device took me around 5 to 10 minutes to build and I am planning on adding more around the house. I am sure I will find other uses for them. But for now, I'm very happy with it. It does what I want it to do and it's very cheap to build. I will leave a link to the BIM file and the components if you are interested in building one. And check out my new store while at it. So that's it for me. Thank you for watching. Peace.